This is when it really gets tense. Only four teams remain in the biggest club competition in the world, and we're not far away from kickoff in the first leg. It's PSG, and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. Good evening everyone, plenty of reasons to expect a compelling contest tonight here on the French capital Paris, we're at the Pacte Pass. I'm Derek Ray and with me here on the commentary box is Stuart Robson and we're getting down to the wire in the UEFA Champions League tonight, the first leg of the semi-final coming right up. It's Paris Saint-Germain facing Barcelona. Well, this is what the Champions League is all about. Some of the world's best players, two excellent teams and a great stadium. Let's hope we're not disappointed. Rafinha introducing the Paris Saint-Germain starters Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts Lucas Hernandez plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence Vitor Ferreira starts with Fabian in the centre of midfield and it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal-scoring threat well this is what we think for Barcelona Marc-André Ter Stegen stands between the posts. Ilkay Gundogan plays alongside Frenkie de Jong in the centre of midfield. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Robert Lewandowski. Oh, nice ball. Lewandowski. Could be. Oh, and it goes! The opening goal in the semi-final. A long way from being decided, but it could be telling. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And then the strike from Lewandowski is absolutely devastating. The keeper just couldn't react to the power of the shot. What a goal that is. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Cancelo. Now with Gunduan. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Lucas Hernandez. Just cutting off the supply. Plenty of support here. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Nordi Mukiele. Good use of advantage in favour of PSG. On attacking possibilities. Mbappe. from that position he really should be doing more to work the goalkeeper Kunde Kunde poor attempt at a pass really the advantage to two just what they wanted and just what they deserve well as you can see he doesn't mess about here does he he's strong well balanced and skillful that's a top class finish so underway again and a 2-0 advantage here Ferreira Dembele on the ball Mbappe no foul PSG advantage well it was one foul too many and the referee simply had to blow for the free kick body in the way well 
Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Could be a chance to break here. Using space on the opposite flank now. And slipped through by Ilkay Gundogan. Brilliantly blocked. And he's kept it out. Fully stretched. Somehow reaching it. It's a short one. That's a nice looking ball. Oh, that's not a good clearance. Joao Cancelo. Sergio Roberto. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Counter attacking chance. Dembele. All in all, a broken counter attack. Sergio Roberto. On to De Jong. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. Well, let's see about the cross. Out of play then. Barcelona throw coming up. And options in the centre. Sergio Roberto. Can he put it in? Nicely saved. Over it comes. Not quite the clearance they were hoping for. Gundogan. And nodding it over. Well, what a good cross that was. He just couldn't keep it under the crossbar. Good effort, though. Lee. Here's Mbappe. And the advantage is with PSG. Well, he's certainly not alone. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Mbappe. Dembele. And that's a very good parry. They need to get tighter. Kangin Lee. Has a go. And even Ter Stegen might wonder how on earth he got there. Well, opting for the short corner. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Araujo. Jules Kunde on the ball. Well, when you're leading, you can afford to be pass happy. Sergio Roberto. Sergio Roberto. Top class defending. Nuno Mensch. Here's Mbappe. Ferreira. Mensch. Oh, breezing past him. Could cross it in here. Fabian. Here's Mbappe. Can he get one back? And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. And a short corner here. And a decent delivery. He succeeds in clearing it. Araujo. Now with Sergio Roberto. Sergio Roberto. Now PSG doing well to regain control of the ball. It's a splendid run by Mbappe. And the keeper there to deal with it. And they will make the change now. 
Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. Playing it short. Marquinhos. Oh, to trim back the lead. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. Not a hard save for Tostegan to make. Frankie de Jong. Not a great pass. Tostegan. Under real pressure here. A goal as they cut into their advantage. Still plenty of life in this match. Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, 2-1 it is here. Kunde. And a fine tackle. Marquinhos. Marquinhos. Will he finish? And the keeper's technical skills there for all to see. Well, from that close in, that's a really good save. Such good reflexes. Dembele tasked with taking the corner. Not all that convincing defensively. That is how to keep it out of the net. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Yeah, he's done OK in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. Well, back underway with PSG looking to find an effective route back into the game. Fabian. The cross is on. Mbappe. Well, that's good defending. Well organised at the back. Now the quick counter attack could be on. That's a good looking ball. That's a nice looking ball. Couldn't grab hold of it. Cleared away. And the defensive intervention there. Toro Muani. Mbappe. Now PSG moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Now the cutback. Nicely blocked. De Jong Barcelona a little wasteful in possession Ferreira good use of advantage in favour of PSG terrific save well the crowd are doing their bit can they find the equaliser here and taken short and with that the attack fizzles out Another corner kick conceded. Let's see what they do this time. They take it short. Dembele. And it's still on. Oh, marvellous set. Well, the pass got in the way. Well, no damage done. Rafinha. Now with Sergi Roberto. Kunde. On to Sergi Roberto. Gundogan. Really nice ball. And it's in! A goal for Barcelona! They 
now the team in charge. Well, here it is again. What a ball that is over the top of the defence. It's weighted perfectly, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Fabian. Here's Mbappe. And the advantage is with PSG. It needs an accurate cross. Chance to make a game of it here. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. And played short. Tempele. A oh, strong hand on the ball. Rafinha. Barcelona, free kick. It'll be here. Sergio Roberto. Kunde, the delivery, a deft clearance. Ferreira. And it's Barcelona's turn now. Mbappe. Joao Cancelo, Lewandowski now. Commitment to passing and attacking, Gundogan. Genuine chance, there it is, a fantastic goal, and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit, that's a good finish, great composure. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. Well, the ball is moving again. And Barcelona really cantering to victory now. Mbappe. Mbappe. Kono Muani. Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. Well, a chance for his second there. Probably should have done a bit better there, really. Favouring the short one. Has eyes for goal. Huge block. It's one corner after another. And deciding to go short with this one. Corner again. And short it is. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Twenty minutes to go. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Getting forward. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Got to it easily, the keeper. Rafinha. Advantage, Barcelona. Lewandowski. to go in it goes he's made it a brace for himself no stopping him apparently well as you can see not much power but great accuracy he made that look so easy didn't he a glut of goals 5-1 it is 
Fabian. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. This attack looks highly promising. Now just the tackle that was needed. Fabian. Oh, might be. A goal here. Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, here you can see what a good goal this is. He hits it so cleanly and the keeper has no chance. That's a great strike. Joao Cancelo. Kunde. And given away, Mbappe. Could be a chance to break here. Cancelo, and passing it well. And the flag was up in good time, it's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Colo Muani Mensch It will be a Paris Saint-Germain free kick PSG have been readying two substitutes and now both will come on Mbappe oh beating his opponent with ease well they pulled one back but perhaps a bit too late in this contest they haven't been at the races this evening Well, let's have another look at this because Mbappe shows such skill to go beyond the defender and then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such venom. Great goal. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Kunde, well, keeping the ball in this manner can be very effective. Good ball over the top. A very effective clearance. Minch. Now the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can he get one back? And keeping it out. Fired over by Usman Dembele. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Dembele. Corner given to PSG. And still an opportunity. Mbappe. Oh, another goal! You just cannot keep them down. And it sets up a furious finish. Well, look at this again. No real power, but great understanding of the situation. That's an excellent goal. Well, I must say, I'd have to go back quite a few years to remember the last time I covered a game with a scoreline of 5-4. Joao Cancelo... 
Jules Koundé on the ball. It's with Joao Cancelo. Rafinha. And a tidy ball. Cancelo. And snuffed out the danger immediately. PSG simply must be opportunistic with time not on their side. Pulls it back. Splendid defending. Full time then, and Barcelona will take a lead with them into the return match. Yeah, that was a tight game, and I think they just about deserve their lead. But it's a slender one, and they'll certainly need to defend well in the second leg if they're to reach the final. As a footballer, you can never be quite sure how it's all going to unfold. But suffice it to say, it unfolded positively for Gundogan. Well, he did everything today. His energy, skill and movement was just too good for those defenders. It was a really 